Good morning, family. Good morning. If you're in your car right now driving, you're going to have a nice drive. Understand your day is going to be great. If you're at home, uh, you know, cleaning up some stuff in the crib, your day is going to be great because why we're back up, we're back pumping, we're back over the 3000 threshold. Okay. Now, of course, as you guys know, we have been, people have been selling, people have been selling. We expected of that. Who wouldn't? You know, if they're day trading and doing all this, or if they have been holding for a long time. So, for example, before I even get to the charts, for example, if you bought Doge and Lamar's in April 2021 and you bought a big bag and you didn't sell, you see what I'm saying? You didn't sell when you first hold it when it had nine to ten zeros. And then, you know, where we went up right now, I mean, you could have sold, you could have sold even when we were higher. But I don't really think that, you know, people like that is selling. But this is the main cause of why we are dealing with this retracement. As you guys see, new, it appears that a large amount of Bitcoin mined in 2010 was dumped following the all time high, uh, partially contributing to today's price correction. Bitcoin moving from old hands to new hands. And the guy who tweeted it, he said, some dude who held Bitcoin for 14 years decided to sell today and nuke Bitcoin. So that's what happened. You know, that's a that's what you call a diamond hand holder. Now, most of you guys say, well, what do you mean? You know what I'm saying? But he been he been mining it since. He been mining it since. Forgot about it. He may have forgot about it, but like, damn, you know. Dang, I, I, I got me some Bitcoin mine. Let me go ahead and sell it. You know, we're already at the highs, but he probably sold a little bit. He probably sold a little bit because he probably still have a whole lot more Bitcoin that he's willing to sell later down in the line. As you guys see with Doge Lamars, Mars, we're down by 9% sitting at 3264 on CoinGecko. As you guys see, we have, we also have sellers as well. So the market has been temporarily temporarily red, which you know that that's understandable. We're gonna go we're gonna go through it. Most of these other assets are going through it, but like what I said in the other video, if these exchanges crash, then crash then. You know what I'm saying? So I wanted to come back with you guys with this. You know, with the whole Doge on Mars burning and everything that is happening, that's going to happen. You know, Doge Lon, he still making that decision. They're gonna make that play. The devs are really working. So as you guys see, 1.8 trillion Shiba Inu shifted in recent hours. Robinhood snaps up 1.25 trillion Shiba Inu. Now, why am I reading this? Listen, they're already getting picked up. Shiba Inu and Doge Lawn, they they've been on the scene. They've been on the scene. So while they're throwing the media to have you go ahead and look at Shiba Inu. A lot of people wasn't knowing about these other tokens that had more 100 times X's than the other digital assets. But you guys see what's going on, right? You guys see. So this is why I'm so, like, high. I'm, I'm so high over of knowing that these crypto markets is about to explode. Shiba Inu been doing this burns as well. So as you guys see, SEC pushes back decision on BlackRock, Fidelity's Ethereum ETF applications. So they say May 23rd is the final deadline for some applications and the final uh, to have a final decision. We're on the Ethereum blockchain, which we're going to have that major push. If they approve it and people start buying Ethereum and you're seeing Ethereum at different price levels, 4,000, 5,000, then you already know that Doge on Mars is about, listen, man, I'm just happy that we in it. We are in this space. That's all I'm going to say. So as you see, Chris Crypto, he says, lots of uh, fatality and incessant barrage of traffic, about 10x verse last week. The platform performed reliably with 100% uptime. Proud of our team. What she's talking about, the whole crypto.com. They haven't crashed. Ain't nothing happened. But if you guys understand this, check this out. Y'all remember when we were logged out of our crypto.com apps? Because they had to update it. They see Chris knew 
Chris knows something big is about to happen. I want you guys to refresh your memories when crypto.com kicked you guys out of your accounts. So because they had updated their system. There's going to be a major pump on the way. And Chris Crypto holds tons of Doge on Mars. And he wants to prove to other exchanges that crypto crypto.com is where all retail investors need to be at. So as you see right here, MicroStrategy increases latest stock sale. So they're selling their shares to $700 million. Expect to close in days. So what does that mean? More Bitcoin buy demand is coming. It's income. It's happening. So once they start buying up more Bitcoin, prices are going to surge a lot more. Listen, Michael Saylor is a smart, smart individual. And what he was doing when everybody, I'm going to be honest with you, some people jumped off of uh, what? four-story uh, hotels or condominiums in New York because their money crashed. What this gentleman did, he went and bought more Bitcoin while everybody else was selling and they were scared. That's a shark. So just like how Dogelon decreased for those two years and for people crying, thinking that, oh, well, we haven't moved for two years. Hey, people like Michael Saylor, are buying up Dogelon. They're accumulating. They're not stopping. Even though the market is going, you see Michael Saylor is still buying Bitcoin at $66,000. What is that right now? It retraced down to 65000 So with him still accumulating at these prices here, he knows that it's going to be a lot more. Uh, the price of Bitcoin is going to be a lot more higher than these uh financial analysts think the predictions he knows bitcoin will be a lot more higher where other people don't have that same belief just like how people have people in the comment section do you really think we could reach point zero 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 four three zeros and a four you don't uh what's your prediction about can you why do you say dojalon could reach 10 cents how is that possible well, they're saying Shiba Inu could touch a dollar. I'm just going to 10 cents. Do you understand what I'm saying? So this is major. This is major. And I want y'all to understand this is major. It's not just some crap that you guys are thinking that it's not nothing. It is something, family. It's definitely something. So back to... uh. Doge line, we're down nine percent on uh coin market cap, sitting at 32.59, as you guys know it. Um, as we hit the trading view, I mean, we had to retrace them, we had that little dip, you know. We we went back down to the what the 2200 levels, 23. So, family, that 4,000 barrier is not going to be nothing. We are, we're not even in a bull run right now we're not in a bull run so i know you guys are like man you know those are some good prices these are still good prices because we are at six zeros so it's going to be a time when you guys see listen when it, when we hit five zeros and we're up the high 23 uh thousands 2300s you guys are going to see a major I'm just going to give you an example. You can see a major change in your portfolio. I'm just going to be honest with you. If you bought a billion tokens of Doge on Mars at $173 and then it goes up to what? Let's just say let's just say five zeros five zeros 1500s. All right. Times that one, two, three, four, five, eleven hundred. Let's say fifteen hundred. That's fifteen hundred dollars. That's fifteen hundred dollars from only you investing into one hundred seventy-five dollars worth of Dogelon. That's a billion tokens. Held it to and went all the way to five zeros, fifteen hundreds. That's fifteen hundred damn 
dollars right now. Like, what are you guys not seeing? What are you guys not seeing? So this is why I say we can break these zeros. The least I expect is three zeros, high four thousands. It could be a lot more higher than that. So once again, you guys have a great morning. I'm going to go ahead and, uh, you know, if I see any more updates, I will drop it to you guys. But I appreciate all the new subscribers, all the new members that have been joining this channel. Um, I will be coming out with some merch soon, you know, my some like coffee cups because, you know, I know y'all y'all drink coffee. All y'all have to drink some coffee. So, you know, I'm going to have some coffee cups and um, I'm just going to have a designer, you know, design me some uh, like not jackets because it's probably not cold where you at and it's not cold where we where I'm at. I'm in Florida. So probably like some shirts or some tank tops, whatnot. Y'all drop the ideas down below. What y'all think I should just, you know what I'm saying, start having my merch to be. But definitely, it's going to be coffee cups. So when I'm on live or doing these videos, you can see my coffee cup. I'm going to be sipping because I do drink some coffee or some tea, green tea. Peace out, family.